Welcome back, this is Yamajack, and today we got Gunslinger, Milltown, Burger King, Suicidal. You like that voice that I can do? You like that voice? I don't. Today, I, uh, today I've got a Terraria update for you, so we're gonna pivot right quickly here. I, uh, this used to be a big ol' empty space before, and I've filled it all in, and then cleaned it up a little bit, put it the, uh, the angler in this room here, and made a nice little teleporter thing over here. I'll have to build the surface half of it, <laughs> you know, but uh, yeah, it's going pretty good. We got all the stuff that we need for fishing and potions over here, a nice little teleporter, nice little area with some ambiance. And on top of that, uh, I've recently discovered that I can just search for music and then YouTube gives me a mix and it's all music that I like. So this is, I mean, like, it's all pretty, it's not the greatest music in the world, but like, it's not. It's nice variety. It just kind of puts something together based on the kind of stuff that I've been listening to anyway, and it's it's been really nice as I've been uh, doing anything really, and just, and just having kind of a lot of music that I enjoy just kind of happening in the background without so without any kind of interaction or anything like that. For me, I used to be very against the mixes, and for the most part, I still am. Uh, because it's not looking for music that I like. It's looking for videos that are like what I like, you know what I mean? I, I, it is kind of looking for music, but like it's not its not just a music thing. You, you can find videos and, and mixes of, of that kind, like auto-generated mixes of, uh, of videos that you might like, not necessarily music too, and, and those I just I don't like because it's not, it's not like I like videos, you know, like Northern Lion. No, I, I like specifically Northern Lion, so when I'm watching Northern Lion, it's like, you're a mix! Yeah, it's just going to be all Northern Line videos, which I've already watched anyway, so... And if it isn't Northern Line videos, then I don't really want to watch them. My, uh, my tastes are too diverse. And, and, well, too diverse and then also too specific, you know? It's like, I like a lot of different things, but of those different things, there are only a few things within that, like, subcategories that I actually like, you know? Like, I like gaming contents. But I like Northern Line, I like Etho, I like Zisto, I like, you know, these specific people. And then I like cooking, but I like, you know, these specific people. And then I like, um, you know, just, I don't know. It's, it's just, you can't really put together an auto-generated mix for me and have me enjoy it so much. Maybe a couple of the videos, but I'm not, I'm not spending the time watching a bunch of videos I'm not going to like, you know? But I tried out the, uh, the music generating thing, the music playlist generator thing. And it's been, uh, it's been very, very nice, honestly. It's been very, very nice to have. I love that slow that you get as Gunslinger on the enemies. Like, you just headshot them, and then all of a sudden they're like... It's not, uh, it's not their walking speed is slowed. It's like their entire animation speed is slowed. And it's, it's just... It may, it's so amusing when you, when you headshot something, and then just everything about them just comes crawling to... A relative halt, anyway. It's it's quite a significant uh, reduction in their overall speed, which is nice and 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 very amusing to me. Very highly amusing. My God, this is too much. This is too much. This is too much. Uh, the first video of. Some stuff on the new channel is going to be coming out this week sometime. I haven't decided what day stuff is going to go up yet. So I've still got to kind of, like, figure that out and then upload the stuff on that day. I'm thinking for now I'm going to get rid of the RuneScape series as well. I'll, 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 I'll add it later, but I, I, I think... I'm not playing RuneScape right now anyway. Um, I don't really have any interest to. Honestly, I, I kind of do, but I also kind of don't, so I, I'd like to just have more time to spend in, in, like, free time. So we'll, we'll, we'll skip the RuneScape for now, we'll just have the, the Minecraft, the two Minecraft series, uh, the Yamachak Tries, the Gunfire Reborn. Yeah, that'll be it. And I'll just, I'll figure out what days they're going to be going up on. I'm not, I'm not sure, I'm not sure. There's a lot of there's a lot of days in the week, you know. Any of them could do. Any of them could do. And then and then you know within that I gotta figure out what time is gonna go up. A few more things for for me to figure out for for just logistically for it to kind of go up. I haven't decided, but I'm gonna you know this week 
Um, well, I, I guess what I'll say is within seven days there will be an upload. Uh, if I can't decide, I'm just going to default to uh, the first Minecraft video going up on Monday. Next Monday, or, or this coming Monday? Today's Monday, but the, the, the next Monday that comes... Is that this Monday or next Monday? I never know. I never. I don't know how this stuff works. Nobody's nobody's taught me. It's not something that's taught in school. It's just something that uh, you learn in, in, in time. But I never really learned it, so I don't really know. I just kind of pretend to know. But I, I actually don't know. <laughs> is, is it this Monday or next Monday? I'm talking, of course, about the 14th. 11 days prior to... Uh, what is it? Uh, Dies Natalis or something? The, uh, the Roman sun god holiday. Also known as Christmas for many people. Christmas is a fun day, right? Christmas is a fun day. That's that repeating. I talked about it recently, but that's, that's, that's that repeating that I talk about. Um, but Christmas is a fun day, because, uh, I don't mean, I don't mean Christmas in, uh, you know, when Christmas comes I'm having fun, no, 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 the day itself as a concept is, is quite fun, because everybody thinks that they're the ones who picked Christmas as being the day that, uh, is important to them, you know, like, if, if you're Christian or whatever, and, and you celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ on Christmas, that's great. Technically, he wasn't born on Christmas, and, and technically, I believe you guys just stole it from the pagans when you were like, Ha! You cannot be pagan anymore! We're gonna take your holidays! And that's cool, because that's basically how everything in the world kind of happens. <laughs> Which is sad. Um, but even, you know, then, like, I don't think that they were the first ones to have come up with the 25th. So it's just kind of like this this thing where it just keeps cycling and... You know, one culture comes up and is like, ah, the, the 25th is a good day. Well, we don't want you having a good time on the 25th, so we're going to make it about us instead. And uh, who knows Who knows what the next one will be? Some some new religion in a few thousand years. Who knows, dude. But, uh... It'll happen eventually. Or we'll die. One, one or the other. But it, it's just, it's, it's funny, because... The 25th is such a significant day across, like, history. In, in like, so many different cultures. And, uh... Every, everybody's like, yeah, it's our day. You know? Like I said, the Christians think it's the day that Jesus Christ will... I mean, I'm sure a lot of Christians... know that Jesus Christ wasn't born on the 25th, and it's just a day that you celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ. It's not actually like he was born. He was born, like, June or May or something like that. Can't remember. Um... Same same thing with like Easter. It's like Easter is supposed to be the the day that uh, like that's supposed to be. I don't I don't remember. That's like the day that he was crucified or came back from being crucified or, or whatever. I don't like I'm not a you know theological kind of person, right? I don't I don't know too too much, but it always it always kind of was funny to me because uh, my grandmother in, in particular is, is like super super Christian and uh, it was whenever I would bring it up I was like why do we celebrate Easter on a different day every year if it's celebrating the day that something happened you know like if we're celebrating I don't know is it when he was crucified we'll, we'll say it was okay if we're celebrating you know Jesus coming back or whatever is it the second coming of Jesus? I don't know. I don't know this stuff, dude. But I think, I think it's the second coming of Jesus, okay? If we're celebrating the second coming of Jesus, or whatever it is that, that happens on Easter, why does it change days every year? <laughs> and that, that always kind of confused me, and, and people were upset when I would question it. And I'm like, I don't, just, like, it's okay if you just have a, you know, thing that you do, and, and that's just how it works. We'll use my barrier here. Um, like that's okay. It's just I don't I don't really get why people are so adamant that like this is the day that this thing happened when it's just like demonstrably false. Especially Easter, but Christmas as well. You know, just uh, 
It's always fun. I talked about my uh, I talked with my grandmother about uh, you know when I was when I was, uh, when I was young I was I was a uh, you know angsty teen kind of thing right like realistically you don't have to go up to Christians and be like did you know that Jesus Christ wasn't born on Christmas you dummy why are you celebrating Christmas it's like it doesn't matter it's it, it that's not the point right like the the point is 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 a celebration it's not really about Jesus Christ it's really about capitalism and spending all of your money to make a whole bunch of corporations super rich as they work you to the bone, you know, 4 p.m. on Christmas Eve. And uh, then go and give your presents to all the people who don't really care about the presents that you're giving them, and it's probably all going to end up, you know, getting tossed in the garbage in the next year or so. Yeah, it's a bit of a... Maybe that's the new religion, capitalism. Anyway, you know you don't have to like do that. But when I was a kid, I uh, it was Christmas and I uh, I don't know. I I wasn't trying to be like edgy or whatever. I was just you know, hey, did you know that Jesus Christ actually wasn't born on Christmas Day? Like, that's not when he was born. Um, and uh, I got like every it, it, it turned into such a huge argument, and I'm like I just I don't get. I mean, in the first place, I don't get when you can just blindly believe something that's just demonstrably false. Like, if you're, if you, have, if you believe in in God or if you believe in whatever, that's not demonstrably false, right? We can't demonstrate that there is no God. The burden of proof doesn't lie with us. The the burden of proof definitely lies with with you, but. Clearly, you you felt that you've you've got enough proof for yourself to, to be able to believe in that, whether it's it's true or not. It's you know the the, the evidence is, is there for for you to make a. I was gonna say educational, but I don't think that uh, it is necessarily educational. Um, but the, the 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 evidence is there for you to be able to make a personal decision for your life about whether or not there is a god or there are gods or whatever religion it is that you believe in. That's, we can't demonstrate that that's not right, right? Like, we can't prove that there is no God. So if, if you want to believe in it, that's... I have I have no issues with that, okay? None, none at all. None at all. But, uh, and I'm going to use Easter here just because it's it's much more demonstrably false. Um, but if, if you're going to argue that a different day every year is the day that Jesus came back to life. I think it's a little bit silly. You know, like, it's it's okay to just have a holiday that doesn't make sense. You know? For you to just celebrate it, and, and that's just the day that you celebrate it. Like, I don't celebrate my birthday on my birthday either. I barely celebrate my birthday at all, but when I do, it's, it's definitely not on my birthday. Right, I don't, I don't celebrate it you know, September 30th and be like, ah, well, actually, my birthday this year is September 30th. No, I just say, like, my birthday is September 10th, we're celebrating on the 30th, you know, like, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. And, and it's a similar kind of thing with Christmas, like, that's not when Jesus was born, but it's okay to celebrate his birth on the 25th, if that's what you want to do. I just, I don't get the, the adamants, because I got, I got in, like, trouble for it. Like, I was, I was actually, like... I wasn't punished, but there was there was definitely some arguments and definitely like uh, you know a firm don't bring this up again. You're wrong. We, you're not talking about this kind of thing, and I'm just like I I just I don't get how you can believe in something so strongly like that. Like I just I don't I don't get it that 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 when. Evidence or, or, or even proof is, is brought to your attention about uh, about it that that you wouldn't you'd, you'd still continue just kind of blindly believing in it. And it's not that uh, that all religion is 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 blindly believing in in you know some kind of nonsense or whatever. It's more that specific parts of it are nonsense, right? Like if you talk to any reasonable Christian, they're gonna be like, yeah, you know, it's more about your own personal like interpretation of it and about the morals and the ethics of it more than um, you know whatever else. Like there isn't. There aren't too many people going around believing that the Earth is actually, you know, what, 6,000 years old or something like that? Like, that's the kind of stuff that, that uh, 
that that I uh, I have issues with. You know, people denying evolution or or uh, the age of the Earth or you know any of that kind of stuff. That's just like you're just wrong. You know, it's not it's not even about your religion. It's 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 just that you're just wrong. You know, like it doesn't work that way. I just I don't uh, I, I, it, it boggles my mind how how so many people. And it's not even just religion either, okay? It's not it's not just a religion thing. I'm, I'm using religion because we started this with, uh, with Christmas, but it's not even it's not even just a religion thing with um perhaps with anything, you know, people who who won't vaccinate their kids. You know, I've I've seen posts by people whose kids have died to a preventable disease. And and they're using it as some kind of like inspirational thing, like make sure you know I I lapsed on my oils for a few days. Make sure you're you're not doing that. Your kids could be in danger. I'm like you just you. You killed your kid. Is is really what it boils down to, and you know you're just kind of still in denial about it. And it just it just. That's that's the kind of stuff that I just I can't get. Is is that blind? belief in 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 whatever it is that you believe in even when all of the evidence points to the contrary oh the number the number of posts i i see and like people talking and stuff about uh you know hey i've uh i've just started to get into anti-vax I've, I've tried researching um the benefits of not vaccinating uh, but everything I can find is talking about how it is good to vaccinate. Um, just wondering if anybody has, you know, like, and they're like being serious about it too. They're like seriously being like, I can't find anything that supports this, but I believe it. Uh, can you please give me some, some kind of resource to, to be able to, to show to these people that like you shouldn't vaccinate? And I'm like, literally doing the research. It's literally telling you that you're wrong, and you're still not believing it. I just it it baffles my mind how how firmly people can believe in things like that. And and again, it's it's not an anti-religion thing. I don't care if you're religious. I don't care if you have you know this belief or that belief. Okay, it's, it's just when you believe something that is just like literally demonstrably false. Um. That, that I that I, I think you're kind of a dummy. That I, that I think you might be a little bit of a dummy. You know? Which isn't is in most things with religion. Like most things with religion aren't demonstrably false, okay? I just I, I wanna I wanna clarify that I got nothing against religion. I just I have an issue if you're denying how old the world is. We have fossils from much more than six thousand years ago or however old the Bible says the uh, the Earth is. We have, we have fossils. We have trees older than that. Like we, it's older. You know we we have a lot of papers showing that uh, vaccines don't cause autism. And and besides, oh that that one's one. That's one that gets me is the whole like vaccines cause autism thing. Cause I'm just like, let's let's say that vaccines do cause autism for a moment. Let's let's play into that for just a, a, a mere brief moment in time here, okay? You can't hit me. This is this is an impenetrable barrier. We've been over this before. Let's let's say for an, a moment in time that uh, that uh, vaccines do cause autism. I would still get vaccinated because autism is better than like death. <laughs> you know, you know? Like I just, even if it causes autism, I, I don't see the argument where dying is better than having autism. It doesn't cause autism, but I just, it's, uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, moral of the story of this whole video is that, like, stupid people are stupid. It's, it's not been religious. And Christmas is a, is a fun day, because... So many different places celebrate Christmas for so many different reasons, and everybody thinks they're the, the right one. It's just it's it's a, it's it's kind of amusing. I actually I went to um. Uh, we're getting into kind of some anti-religion stuff, I guess, at that point, but it's okay. 
Again, I'm not I'm not anti-religion, okay? I uh I personally don't have any beliefs one way or the other. But uh yeah, you know, I, I believe in things I can see and, you know, experiment with personally. Um but uh I don't have anything against it if anybody's religious or whatever. But I went to a uh, youth group, a church youth group a while back, and they were talking about um, other religions. They're like, you know, all these other religions, they have their gods, and, and they have, you know, this thing, and they have that thing. and But we have ours. And you know what the difference is? We're right. <laughs> and I'm like, really? Your argument for why... You're Christian and not, you know, a Buddhist. Is that you're right? It's it's it, <laughs> there. There's no like evidence. There's no argument to be made. It's it's just yeah. I'm right. You're wrong. So suck it. And I'm I'm, I'm sure that most Christians are not like that. I'm, I'm sure most Christians are are I don't know. Honestly, I'm pretty sure that most Christians are pretty honest about how... Well, I was raised Christian, so... And, uh... That's, that's how they ended up being Christian themselves. But that that, that was... I, 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 it was really hard for me to not laugh in the middle of the, the speech. Because <laughs> I'm just like, really? Just literally, we're right, you're wrong, so suck it. Literally, I'm like, oh my god. It's that kind of just sheer, like, unfettered confidence in your beliefs that just makes me laugh. You know? To just deny things that, that prove you're wrong. Or, or to just not even open the, the, the possibility of being wrong. It's that kind of stance on things that I just... I find so silly. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like. And subscribe to see more of the future comedy. If you to say we'll not be playing Ashwood Asylum. I'm skipping. I'm picking maps myself. I wanted to see if it would give us something. But of course it gives us Ashwood Asylum. Anyway, bye.